agreeable day for football and that's exactly what we've got my name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here it is Tottenham Hotspur up against Juventus well Derek as is always the case the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game and that for me is the area that's key today getting anxious when they have the ball well the perfect tackle really and now a throw in to jump in front in it goes that will do nicely for starters first goal of the game well as you can see it was a fairly simple finish in the end but you still have to be in the right place keep your composure and finish it off and that's exactly what he did and the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Miguel Almiron. Ruud Hulit. Eder Militao. Michael Balak. Teo Hernandez. It. Victor Ozimhen. Juventus have given it away. Now, who can he play it to? Balak. It is advantage, Juve. Douglas! Not out of the woods yet. Well, nothing comes of it. Vinicius Junior. A Juve free kick here. Ozim Hen. And taken away. He won the ball. And close but offside nonetheless. Ozim Hen. The, fourth official has the electronic board the has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. It's going to be a free kick for Juventus. Well, no surprise to see him go for goal, but a routine save in the end. And there it is, the half time whistle. And so the second half is underway with Juventus, the old lady, in need of a lift. Oh, that's a fine pass. Teo Hernandez. So to the keeper. Ruud Hulit. Miguel Almiron. Oh, surely. And a goal! They've increased their lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. It's a substitution for Juventus. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Vinicius Jr. could pull one back here. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Good tackle. Kenny Dalglish. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tight in here. Deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. 
So back underway at 3-1. And a goal kick is the outcome. Eder Militao. Almiron. Well, a good tackle. At times they make passing look easy. And can they prize them open now? Just 10 minutes to go. Effective looking pass. Well read to put an end to that attack. Rud Hulit in with a chance. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. And the Juventus personnel change here. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. Opportunity here. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been up the best. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was... And there goes the final whistle.